Hello Aquarius, thank you for joining me. This is your general love reading for the week beginning August the 21st through the 27th. We'll take a look at your energy and your companion's energy or energy coming toward you and we'll look at the past, present, future. The energy at the bottom of the deck is the Six of Pentacles and just from this card alone, I feel like there's going to be issues about inequality or the need to work together because something is out of whack. Something's not reciprocal. There, the energy is different between the two of you. I can already tell just by this card here. Okay, so you have the Ace of Wands. They have the Seven of Wands and the Page of Wands. So there's passion. You got passion. Uh, what else do you have? Um, I mean, you definitely, this was, this was definitely a new beginning for you. And I think it was kind of like, um, a really f fresh energy for you. You um, you felt very good. The partner showing up more as a defensive kind of energy, and I don't know if it's because they've been hurt in the past, what it is, but there's definitely, they they definitely are more about protecting themselves and they don't want to get hurt. And then the Page of Wands is just about how you're having a lot of sex, you're having a lot of fun, you're having, um, trying some new experiences, whether that be sexual or just in your day-to-day -day exchange. So, so far we, we just have, we have passion. We have passion here. In the current situation, you have the Seven of Swords. Um, it's like you're trying to strategize something here. Uh, or you're considering maybe talking to somebody from the past. Um, and they have the justice card. So the energy there is about um, honesty. They, they may be feeling that there's something or someone from your past that's trying to intrude in this relationship whether you're talking to that somebody on social media and they saw that, it's kind of um, immature sort of energy. So they're defensive, I feel like, because they feel like you're hiding something. And with the fool here, you're, you're both gonna have to, have to drop the defensiveness, drop the talking to other people and start focusing on the current energy and start putting your energy and your risk taking into your current relationship if you want it to work. The future, you have the High Priestess, which is about using your, the High Priestess is a very sacred, um, very wise sort of energy. So that's really something that you're going to need to tap into um, and let that guide your actions. So there's an inner voice that's trying to scream out to you, Aquarius, and uh, yeah, it's trying to get your attention for sure because your partner, your partner's all over the place. Now they have a Four of Cups sort of energy, which is about um, it's like, oh, this was fun, but now I'm not having fun. So I don't know. Their energy is all over the place, and I don't see them being very reflective on their emotions or their desires. They're just kind of it kind of changes day by day and 
Yeah, the last card of Ten of Wands. So this relationship, if it's going to work out, it's going to take a lot of work. It's going to take a lot of work, a lot of responsibility. There's going to be a lot of challenges. That doesn't mean that it can't work, but the two of you have to be committed together in order for this connection to be a strong connection. 